perfect. 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 Wow. 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 I mean, I mean, that's all I can say right now. I mean, I'm literally astonished, man. Shout out to the Milwaukee Bucks. They just won the NBA Finals by a final series score of 4-2. to two. The Bucks finish off the Suns in Milwaukee. After losing the first two, they win four straight in a row. Look, man, Giannis puts up 50 points. I have a profound respect for Giannis Antetokounmpo. I really do. I have a new profound respect for Giannis Antetokounmpo. He's never been my favorite player. He's never been a player where, you know, he's been one of my favorite outside of my own team. But I have a new respect for Giannis. He did it. He came out. He grinded. He he was very gritty. And he's just a dog, man. And he went out and got it done. Who would have thought Chris Middleton would have stepped up, in, you know, in the way that he did in some of these games? Who would have thought... Drew Holiday, especially on the defensive end, would have stepped up the way that he did. The Milwaukee Bucks just changed the NBA forever. Brooke Lopez as your starting center on a championship team. I, I mean, it's just absolutely insane. Mike Boonholzer gets it done. He gets a ring. The Bucks just won the finals with Giannis as their top option and, and Chris Middleton as their second option. I, I can't believe it. I really can't. How about the Phoenix Suns, man? I'm so disappointed for the Suns. Chris Paul, despite how great of a point guard he is, he's one of the best of all time, he will go down most likely without a ring. This was his best chance to win it. Look, it's been a weird year. Again, much respect to the Milwaukee Bucks. It's been an insane year. You know, all the injuries, all the crazy circumstances. This was the Phoenix Suns and Chris Paul's best chance to win a championship. Devin Booker could not pull through. The rest of the Cats, man, I feel like I, I cursed the Phoenix Suns. After game two, I literally was saying how Mike Hell Bridges and all these guys were going to get a ring, and they lost four straight. I might have cursed them. I'm sorry. But look, man, disappointing. Disappointing for Chris Paul and his career. I mean, with, with the way everything went this year, it seemed like this was his best chance, and I don't know if he'll ever get back. After game two, they started to play a lot of isolation ball. They, they literally started to play completely different as a team. Um, they did not keep up on the defensive end. And the Bucs just came out with, a, you know, an insane amount of energy. And again, I just have a new garnered respect for Giannis. And, and that's kind of what I want to talk about. Um, don't ever compare Ben Simmons to Giannis Antetokounmpo ever again. And look, I'm not going to just sit here and sin, slander Ben. I'm literally on vacation. Um, look. Don't ever compare Ben to Giannis again. We used to say these guys were similar, their career paths and all that. Listen, man, Giannis came from the streets of Greece. This guy grinded. He worked as hard as he could. He, he is so hungry, man. And you can just see it every single game. And it gets more and more each game. Just the energy he feeds off. I, I mean, it was insane, the performance that he put up in this finals. And, and you just have to respect the guy, man. He was never handed anything. Him and his brother were literally, I remember watching a documentary, they were fighting for their next meal. They literally bet on themselves. And just to see where he got today, man. And Giannis just worked so, so hard. You could tell the passion was overflowing outside of him. And it led the Bucs to this win. I never would have thought with Giannis as the top option on, on a championship team that it would work, but it did. The Milwaukee Bucks are NBA champions, and I, I can't believe it. I really can't believe it. The Bucks just changed the NBA landscape forever. No matter what you say about these finals, no matter what you thought, you know, in its originality about these finals, given the fact of all the injuries and, the, and you know, not a lot of stars like a typical NBA finals, the Bucks just did it. This was a classic and they got it done. I can't believe it. Chris Paul and the Suns ended up choking, man. A great season for them, but it's very unfortunate. And Giannis is an NBA champion, and the Milwaukee Bucks get it done, man. What a series. Um, ben Simmons and Giannis Antetokounmpo will never be the same NBA player. I was wrong uh, a year or two ago when I said that, and, and wow. The Bucks get it done. They win four straight. And I guess they were just a better team. They were hungrier and they, they played the right brand of basketball. That's all I got, man. Shout out to the Milwaukee Bucks. And uh, hopefully we'll see our Sixers back there next year, man. Hopefully we make the right changes and, uh, you know, we get some guys who are hungry like we saw tonight, man.
You guys have a great one. Peace. Perfect. Perfect. Perfect.